For more than a kilometer stretch of the toy fishing port, these waves are thick with sardines and mackerel, and they're all dead. I don't think this much has ever washed up before. An estimated 1,200 tons of fish have washed ashore since early December. The cause is a mystery to local officials. The uncertainty has led to speculation it could be tied to the release of wastewater from the crippled Fukushima nuclear plant. That's 600 kilometers south on Japan's main island of Honshu. But officials say water monitoring surveys have shown no abnormalities since the country's largest electricity provider, TEPCO, began pumping out water, holding amounts of the radioactive material tritium into the Pacific Ocean in August. One researcher at Hakodate City, where the fishing port lies, says it's unlikely Fukushima seawater reached the northernmost island of Hokkaido. He says sardines would have been headed south to Honshu at this time of year. One possible cause is that the school of fish was chased by a larger fish to exhaustion, then was washed up by the waves. Another possibility is that the school of fish entered frigid waters during their migration, then were washed ashore, but details are uncertain. Authorities are advising residents against eating the fish. Heavy machinery has been brought in to clear up the dead fish, a task that could take until the end of the year. Eunice Kim, Al Jazeera. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.